Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Cory, and for today's video, I'm gonna be sharing with you my flying with my fountain pens experience and this is just a voiceover so i'm really really sorry for all the background noise i documented this uh, over my trip coming to the philippines and i hope that um, you'll get some lessons or you know like how i experienced it as well so yes so how i packed my pens is that i wrapped them individually with the cling film and um, put them in in my Esther Brook to go pen case. It's it's really simple. I just thought of using any plastic to wrap those ziplocs, but I felt that it's really bulky, so I was looking for this in the kitchen, and voila, it's good to go. Seven pens for my June ink pens is coming along with me. Are coming along with me in these rainbow ink colors. So I hope you can also get some insights as how i i mean you can travel along with me let's go So for my first stop, it's in Singapore, Changi Airport, and upon arrival, I was really excited to check on my pens, and yeah, so far, in between my laksa, <laughs> the pens are all good, um, there's no leaking and of sorts, I'm just gonna open them when I arrive in my final destination, in, which is the Philippines, so I asked my daughter to film me as I checked my pens, and all are same as i pack them no leaking and and also yay happy that for the first two hour tri trip no leaking so that's a great update
So for the final verdict, <laughs> we are gonna open it. Just arrived and I'm doing unpacking my things. And now it's time to check my pens. All of them, seven of them are all good. No leaking, no anything that's uh, the thing. The ink is coming from off from the nib. Everything is good, great. As you can see, I'm checking them one by one. And so far, nothing really is out no colors no inky hands so this is a good um adventure for me this is a great experience and i know all some of you are also wondering how was it and i'm really sorry for the delayed compiling these clips and you know editing i spent some time with the family and so yeah i'm sorry for the noisy voiceover but um i hope you'll stick around and i'll see you on my next one bye